8 upgrades? Dude, I did watch some shit about Tekken 8. Psh, first time I've been impressed by that game. Uh, did you see that they're adding a feature in Tekken 8 that lets you watch your replay of a match you've played? And then at any point in the match, you can take 10 seconds of control over your character to try to do something else in that situation. So let's say you got fucked up and you're like, damn, that move is fucking me up. You can take control of your replay and okay, <laughs> in this you. replay, I tried to duck. Let me try to sidestep. Let me try to do this. Let me try to do that. What can I do in this 10 second window of this match to never get hit by that again? That is like... Who, no one ever thought of that. And if they did, it was for a game that no one gives a fuck about, right? I didn't think Tekken 7, I'm sorry, Tekken 8 could, it's a habit because of, you know, 7.5. But I didn't think Tekken 8 could do something, could even do something. Like it wasn't capable of doing something that I had never thought of. Or has, the, has not already been done, at least. I didn't think it would be innovative to that level that's very innovative they also showed some shit too yeah i gotta give it up to murray and harada dude that is so fucking amazing and that's coming from someone who really doesn't give that much of a shit think about it for someone who does that is amazing there's more too they're putting tekken ball mode and it looks to me hey no offense anyone but Tekken Ball mode looks way more fun than Tekken 8 mode. <laughs> and there's online this time, unlike Tekken Bowling. Can you believe these cavemen put Tekken Bowling in the game, but then they didn't let you play online? That was crazy. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> play against my sister? Anyway, that's cool. Um... And there was another thing that was cool. Oh, they they put this emphasis on ghost mode, like the ghost copies your playstyle, and they were talking about how much better it is. <laughs> and you know they always say the that, right? Fine. Like your 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 ghost is not gonna be good. At the end of the day, ghost mode is not gonna be that sick, right? <laughs> right? I don't know. They showed a match of Mishima Star playing against himself. <laughs> they showed a match of Mishima Star playing against his own ghost, and that ghost looked <laughs> pretty fucking buff. I was looking at that ghost like, damn, get that guy his laptop. This ghost is a beast. So I don't know. I'm I'm very skeptical about the whole ghost being actually good, but we'll see. Either way, the pausing your match and taking control of your character to get out of a problem situation in a real match is amazing. That's amazing. And you know what? what's even funnier? Something that I think people aren't even thinking about. So you, these are replays of online matches, right? So there could be occasions where you ducked a high and it didn't work. And then you go into the replay and when your replay is not online and you have no lag, Maybe it'll work. So it will show more occasions of like, well, that's hard to do online, but I could do it every time offline types of things. Because the replay is going to be offline. So it's going to have less latency than it did when it was an actual match online, which I find that type of thing to be interesting. But I can't expect you to. Anyway, you guys want to play uh, Lies of P? I'm pretty hype about it.